Noobs, I don't know what we're going to be doing today. Hey Michael, you're in the frame. Nope. Uh oh, <laughs> he's a little touchy. But that's okay, because we're going to the gay pride parade. It's just that he's a gentleman and people will probably want to touch him. Point being, we're looking for parking, because that's half of the fun of living in Hollywood, is just looking for parking. I don't know what to say next. I'm not gonna give you anything, I don't wanna be in this. You know what, just for that, I think I'm just gonna edit that in. Just you being sassy and like, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. What the fuck is this two hour parking scenario? You cannot escape. <laughs> Alright! Hey noobs! We're still looking for parking. The problem that we're having is... Okay, so it's like three in the afternoon. We've missed all of the important things. It's on a Sunday. The parade is over. We're still looking and it's... Oh! It Did we find it? <gasps> two hour parking, 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Friday then. There are like all of these totem pole parking signs you just you gotta learn how to like it's like a weird version of meh i don't like it two hour parking yeah that makes sense Monday through friday so we're cool Monday through friday oh so i mean like we could still just park and like stay really yeah yeah we can never, leave. <laughs> we can never go anywhere uh but well that means we can park here all day right yeah so this is like for the day like oh the hot damn good job well done we are in Hamburger Mary's, which I've never been before, and I'm so excited because I've lived here like a year and a half and I still have never gone. And it's like uh, a staple to go in Fijo, West Hollywood, which is like basically the LGBT community on this side. Live with Britney Spears and Cher. It's so exciting. We're walking towards the festival. We don't know how far away we are. I'm waiting for someone to sabotage this at any point. Anticipation builds. Michael continues to not like <laughs> I don't know why. I feel like I should be wearing a crop top. I'm not showing enough skin here. basically the worst uh, tour guide ever because that was about it with that was um, yeah that was about the last video that I had of that day anyway so we got to the festival we did have uh, we considered him our guardian angel as Mike and I were walking towards uh, hamburger Mary's we stumbled upon what was his name Joaquin he was our guardian angel and he openly admitted that he was rolling he was the one who was telling us uh, about the festival what to expect because we did miss the parade we missed all of the big things unfortunately and I was like oh this would work great well it turns out to get into the festival it's 20 bucks which I'm a cheapskate so what we ended up doing was it was like a barricaded street there were lots of police officers actually it was right next to a police station so I guess for convenience sake that's what happened so this is basically the only video that I have of the actual festival <laughs> It was hopping. There were people grinding up on each other. Men and women and women and women and guys and guys and it was just a big old love fest. So maybe next year I'll go. Welcome to the lamest tour guide in the whole world. Pride would have been wonderful. We'll have to go next year. I'll have to go to the parade but some people had to volunteer in the morning so that's a big reason why I was not able to go. Noobs, thanks so much for watching. I'm sorry this was a little lame. Next week will be a lot better. I make videos every Tuesday so go ahead and subscribe and you'll see a better video next week. Thanks for watching, noobs.